Hey guys, Anthony here with a tutorial on how to create a children's storybook in Artistly AI, which is an online generative AI design platform. So I'm logged into my Artistly account, and this is the main dashboard area. Click on Create Design, and then choose this option for Fast AI Image Designer. We are currently in the AI Image Designer version 5 section. Click on AI Design Agents, and in this section, you can create three types of storybooks. I'll be creating separate tutorials for each. So for this one, I'll click on Kids Storybooks. Next, click on Create New Story. In step two, we need to complete these individual sections. I'll click on Story Type. You'll see several different types. And I'll choose Moral. Next, I'll use this drop down to choose the age group. In the storybook summary, I'll write a short summary of the story I want to create. Just make sure to be specific about the theme, age, and characters. And finally, I'll choose the number of characters and pages. And then click on Generate Prompts. It will then take a few seconds to generate the prompts for the images, story, and the book cover. So just give it a few seconds. Sometimes this can take a bit uh, of time, and even if you're stuck at the 98% mark, just give it some time. And as you can see here, it has created extensive prompts that we will use to generate the storybook, including the prompts for the front and back book cover. You can use this copy button to copy and paste these prompts to another document as a backup. Next, I'll use this drop down and choose 4x5 for the page dimensions. I'll click on Choose Style. And from this pop up, I'll choose this cartoon style. It'll bring me back to this page. And I'll click on Generate Storybook. It will then start generating the storybook pages, and this can take a few minutes, so just give it some time, and then it's going to redirect you to the personal designs section. Here are the storybook pages it generated based on the script. Let me scroll back down so you can see the ones it generated. Let me scroll back up. Next, we can create the flipbook using my flipbooks. But first, let's generate a front page book cover. I'll click on AI Design Agents. And from these options, click on Book Cover. It will bring you to this page where you need to complete these individual sections. So I'll go ahead and do that. And then click on Generate Prompts. It'll take a few seconds to generate the detailed prompt for this. So just give it a few seconds. And here is the prompt it generated. It's a good idea to copy the prompt and save it to another document as a backup. Next, I'll use this drop down and choose the aspect ratio. I'll go with 4 by 5 and click Generate Book Cover. It will then take a few seconds to process it. So just give it a few seconds. And then it'll bring you to the personal design section. And here is the book cover it generated. I'll click on my flipbooks at the top, and it will bring you to this page. Click on Create New. Make sure that uh, you are in the Kids Storybooks section. Click on Create Flipbook. Check this box, and it will automatically select the rest of the pages. As you can see, it selected 12 pages. I'll then click on Create Flipbook. You'll see the dialog box. Entry of Flipbook Title. Click on Select Voice. And from this pop-up, you can choose the Narration Voice. I'll go with Ethan, and it'll bring you back here. Next, click on Select Template. And you'll see these options. 
Now they will be adding many more of these options here as well as an option for us to upload our own. For now I'm going to go with this one. Next I'll choose from library to choose a front cover. And from the media library I'll choose this one that we generated earlier. And we are back here. If you want to you can upload a back cover. I'll skip this and then click on generate flipbook. It will then start generating the storybook flipbook and then bring you to this page. Now just please note that it can take 5 to 10 minutes to generate the flipbook but this one was uh, generated less than 5 minutes. You will see the status in progress and then once it's generated it will change to ready. You can then use this download button to download the storybook as a PDF document and if you click read it will open a separate tab where you'll be able to see this toolbar at the bottom. You can click this play button and it will automatically play the storybook with the audio narration and you can check the link in the description section to check the storybook. You can also use this arrow button to manually flip each storybook page and go through each page as you can see as I'm doing right here. And this is a pretty nice way to share your storybooks. There is so much more that you can do with Artistly and you can check the link in the description section to try it and get it at a discounted price. Well, I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching.